You've all seen, seen uh, articles saying that global warming stopped in 1998. Well, with all due respect, that's being a little bit unfair to the data. This is 1998 here, and it was a huge El Nino year. And the sun was very active in 1998. And so what you have, you're going to have the fall off here in temperatures, either surface temperatures, either satellite temperatures, as the consequent La Nina, the bubbling up of the cold water that was trapped down there by El Nino, takes place. Because I want to tell you something. Everybody in this audience, make an argument that you can get killed on, and you will kill us all. OK? I think most people in this room are of the conclusion that global warming may be an exaggerated issue. But if you lose credibility on this issue, you lose the issue. What's happened? What's happened? And this is why this argument is so very, very dangerous, is that the solar activity and the El Nino, the La Nina we're in now, have conspired to add up to produce very, very little temperature change in the last couple of years, in the last few years. And so what's going to happen? One of these years, that's going to turn around. And if you make that argument now, you're going to have a very, very difficult time defending the future. Whoops. So. Global warming is real, and the second warming of the 20th century, people have something to do with it, all right? Now get over it.